Okay, I'm back, and as you can see, I've got the uh, airplane back on the uh, CG balance machine. And uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to take these lead weights. Uh, they're great planes, self-adhesive self lead weights. And it took 14 total. Um, uh, each one is uh, 7 grams or a quarter ounce. Um, and it took 14 of them. So what I did was I took two new strips cut uh, seven off on each so they'll be paired on each side and put them on the tail and uh, uh, in a minute I'll show you how I screw them in. I don't trust the the self-adhesive. The self-adhesive is, self is great just to stick them on for the first time but they'll come off uh, especially when you get uh, oil from the engine off. So I actually screw them in, and I'll show you how I do that uh, in just a minute. <clears throat> One tip uh, before I go and take this thing off is note that I have it slightly nose down. Okay, that's okay. Um, you know, straight and level would be that. Okay, and I like my airplanes to have a bit of um, CG with the nose down slightly. Um, and uh, so I could add another one or two uh, squares of lead back there and make it level, but I chose not to. And that's to give it a bit of a nose down that makes it fly better from my perspective. Okay, so the last thing to do is to um, uh, attach the two um, uh, pieces of lead weight to the tail of the aircraft. And so what I've done was I took and drilled a hole. Uh, I stacked these together and drilled a hole through them. The hole is um, um, five sixteenths. Okay, and that fits a uh, a number six thirty two two inch bolt with a uh, nylon nut on it. And I picked a location back here. At the tail of the aircraft where it would not interfere with the um, uh, rudder push rod on this side and uh, now it's simply a, a matter of um, putting this in and uh, getting it through okay and because it's a 632, you need a 764 uh, nut driver. And uh, let me get the uh, our hex driver. And let me get the nut started here. Okay. Um, before I do that, I guess I should. Um, Oh, I don't have to. I think I will, though. Um, I don't think these are ever going to come off, so I don't want them to come off. So before I actually put these on, I'm going to peel the back off where the sticky um, tape is. And uh, Okay, so that one's off. And I'm going to put the bolt through it. That way I make sure it gets lined up right where the hole is first before I get the sticky down. And get the bolt all the way through and then press the sticky side down. And then uh, do the same thing for the other side. Pull that tape off. Okay. Put that on. Squeeze the sticky together. And then we'll put the bolt on, uh, the nut on. As I said, I've had these come off when I didn't 
bolt them on and uh, uh, okay so um, alright <clears throat> so um, that's how you stick them on and uh, make sure they don't come off with a nice uh, two inch long bolt and uh, I like using nylon nuts because they they uh, just won't vibrate off so that's going to hold my lead weights thank you and that completes the CG balance